Okay, I'm going to show you how to uh, move files from your desktop computer to your e-reader. In this case, it would be by using the ActiveSync program that is on your CD. Uh, that is for Windows XP. If you have Windows Vista or Windows 7, you would be downloading the Windows Mobile Device Center from Microsoft and using it. Okay, so I have my cradle hooked up and I'm going to insert my reader into the cradle. Okay, so this is ActiveSync starting and it's asking me do I want a partnership? I'm going to tell it I want a guest partnership. Now if you've set up a standard partnership that's fine but uh, for right now I'm just going to tell it guest partnership. Okay and ActiveSync has started. Now what I would do here is I'm going to first of all go to my hard drive which is drive C and I'm going to find the file I want to transfer and it is in a folder called ebooks and it is this file here, The Luckiest Girl in School. So I'm going to highlight that file. I'm going to click on Edit and Copy. Now what I need to do is I need to go back to my ActiveSync window. So I'm going to minimize Windows Explorer. And here's my ActiveSync window. I'm going to click on Explorer. And what that is now done when I click on Explore, it's opened a window on my reader, and that window is in the My Documents folder on the reader. So all I have to do is click on Edit and Paste, and I click if any uh, messages come up uh, about transferring, I click OK, and it's transferring that file for me, and now that file is in the My Documents folder on the reader. So I know where to go to find it uh, when I want to read it. Uh, we could do the same thing with program files, the CAB files. You would edit and copy, uh, use Windows Explorer and uh, choose edit and copy and then I come over here <coughs> and click on edit and paste and that will also put the CAB files into the My Documents folder and being a program that I want to install I would then use my file explorer to click on that program file and it will self install so that is the that is how you can transfer uh, files from your hard drive to your reader thank you very much